And one of our goals was to portray a black family in a great light and a regular, not stereotypical, but like what people really live like. And the fact that they recognize that and they, they realize that and they supported us, it was a very big deal, very big deal. Although everybody hates Chris, we all love the actor who played him. He's gone on to play a preacher's son with a hidden gift for rapping, a man trying to survive the zombie apocalypse, and recently graced our screens as a teacher at a Philadelphia elementary school. Everyone, it's Tyler James Williams. Tyler James Williams was born in Westchester County, New York in 1992. He, along with his two younger brothers, grew up in Yonkers, New York. Williams caught the entertainment bug at an early age from his mother, a singer and songwriter. At just eight years old, Tyler had his first role on Sesame Street, following it up with voicing Bobby on Little Bill, then small parts on the legendary sketch show Saturday Night Live. In 2005, Tyler's family relocated to Los Angeles to help further his career. This was the year he got his breakout role of Chris on Everybody Hates Chris. The Chris Rock produced and narrated sitcom had Tyler starring alongside Terry Crews and Tashina Arnold. While looking back at his iconic role, Tyler told Variety, my childhood will always be uniquely linked to Chris because so much of my childhood was him. My interpretation of Chris at that time was somebody who was emotionally intelligent and aware of what was happening in the world around him and empathetic. In 2006, the series was nominated for a Golden Globe for Best Television Series, Musical or Comedy. The American Film Institute named it one of 10 Best Television Series in 2007. And Tyler won a 2007 NAACP Image Award for Outstanding Actor in a Comedy Series. Tyler added some notable credits to his resume, appearing in 2006's Unaccompanied Minors, True Jackson VP alongside Kiki Palmer in 2009, and House. Then in 2012, he scored a lead role in Disney's Let It Shine with Coco Jones, Trevor Jackson, and Courtney B. Vance. Williams got to use his secret talents for the role. I've been writing and producing music since I was 13, but I never really wanted to put myself out there. I started out writing poetry, spoken word. That was pretty much how I started, Tyler shared with Channel Guide magazine. Let It Shine was the most watched Disney Channel original movie when it aired, earning 5.7 million viewers and becoming the number one movie across kids and tweens. 2013 brought Tyler to the big screen in Tyler Perry Presents Peoples as Simon Peoples. Then in 2014, he went on to play Lionel Higgins in the 2014 film, Dear White People. The film was different than any comedy he'd acted in to date, exactly what the actor wanted. When the script hit his desk, he was sold. Tyler told Variety Magazine, this is something that can not only possibly define my career, but define a generation. Alongside Tessa Thompson, Tiana Paris, and Dennis Haber, the critically acclaimed film went on to be nominated for a 2015 NAACP Image Award for Outstanding Motion Picture. Later in 2014, Tyler joined the hit cast on the fifth season of The Walking Dead as Noah. The seasoned actor knew about his demise before the script even made it to him. He was tipped off by a simple scene of Rick laying a blanket over his character. He then went on to appear in Criminal Minds, the spinoff Criminal Minds Beyond Borders, then a leading role in the CW's Whiskey Cavalier. Tyler got a chance to dust off his comedic acting chops, appearing in the HBO sketch comedy show, A Black Lady Sketch Show with Robin Thede, Ashley Nicole Black, and his future executive producer and co-star, Quinta Brunson in 2019. It was their connection on a Black Lady Sketch Show that opened the door to the role of Gregory Eddy on Abbott Elementary. 
I saw an opportunity in Gregory Eddy to show black male teachers in a way that I don't think we've really seen before, with a vast emotional spectrum, a deep care for his kids, and getting sucked into this crazy world that is the public school system, regardless of if this is what he planned for his life or not, he said to Huffington Post. Tyler Williams has grown up before our eyes in front of the camera on big and small screens. He's shown his range, giving audiences characters from the hilarious young Chris Rock to Lionel and Dear White People and Gregory Eddy in the hit series Abbott Elementary. Despite seeing this amazing actor for years, there's no doubt more stellar performances are to come.